It wasn't, that wasn't, as you can tell, that just wasn't a giant buck. Uh, I was kind of on the fence on shooting them. So I guess I, it was kind of a sign that I didn't need to. When I, uh, I had made the decision to shoot them, so you could hear my arrow. Uh, this is my first year hunting with a drop away rest on my bow. And I like it. But um, when I went to draw back, you know, like my hand... I mean, I'm not really making an excuse here. I mean, it's still my fault. However, I guess my arrow wasn't notched on the string like I thought it was. So I, I you know, take that for what you will. But my daggum, I, I just kind of tilted my hand to uh, to get a better grip on my bow. My hand's getting a little sweaty. I've been sitting there holding it. And also, I, for whatever reason, every time I attach my release to the string, I just kind of tilt my bow down and when I did that 
gravity, you know, was working and it ripped the uh, the arrow right off my string and it fell down to the ground. And that buck, you can see in the video, he didn't actually even look at me. His ear turned and he just listened, which there were squirrels and acorns falling, everything like that. So he, I guess, wrote it off and it was not as it was nothing. When I got another arrow off of my quiver, he got through the opening that I had to shoot him. And he went on, and that was that. I didn't have any other shot, so. That's, he got away from me. Didn't have any other action at that close encounter. Um, I'm actually filming this a few days removed. That's been the last year I've had a bow range out of the last couple sits. So, I'm headed back to the stand right now. Um, I skipped this morning. Uh, there was actually two mornings I could have went that I skipped and had a nice buck in there. So it is what it is, I guess. Really nice one, actually, that I'd have loved to take him. And then last Friday that I skipped, there was a nice little eight point. He wasn't huge, but probably would have sent one. So headed back out this evening. Honestly, I'll shoot a doe if one comes out. Just trying to thin the herd. See how it goes.